Welcome to H2K Infosys. H2K Infosys is a e-verify business based in Atlanta, Georgia, United States. We provide 100% job-oriented, instructor-led, face-to-face, true live online software training programs. It also includes access to Cloud Test Lab with software tools. We provide live projects for you to work on. We also provide assistance with mock interviews, resume preparation and review, and job placement assistance. H2K Infosys is trusted by so many students across the world. H2K Infosys provides world-class services in IT training with real-time project work for corporates and individuals, special IT training for MS students in the United States, software design development, QA manual and automation, performance testing and maintenance, IT staff augmentation, job placement assistance and tech support. We discussed about uh, you know automation testing. Like uh, what is meant by automation testing, and uh, what are the advantages of automation testing? What are the tools available for automation testing? Okay, like automation testing means test automating the manual testing process is called as automation testing. Okay. The advantage of automation testing, it will be used uh, now when we have repeatable uh, tasks, when we have, uh, you know, when we want a full test coverage, okay, you know, when we have more regressions. So ultimately, here we save cost. Ultimately, here we are going to save, uh, you know, money uh, because we are going to save the efforts, okay. Then we discussed about uh, you know, different tools, mainly QTP and Selenium. Difference between QTP and Selenium. Okay, QTP is a paid tool. Uh, Selenium is a free tool. It's an open source. It's called as open source. We can simply download and we can use it. Okay, and whereas paid uh, QTP is a paid tool, we have to pay some money for it. Okay. It supports uh, you know, web plus other applications, but here it supports only web. Okay, and here uh, you know, it is like limited support for browser. Okay, and here uh, it is. Uh, full support for browser like it supports Internet Explorer Firefox okay Google Chrome Vera okay like this it supports it supports so many browsers, but whereas it is a limited uh, limited part here, okay, and uh, whereas it is supports only in Windows, it supports Windows as well as Mac. So whenever you have a web-based application, nowadays most of the organizations are preparing Selenium because it is free. Apart from that, it is supporting so many browsers, okay, so many browsers with the latest versions too. Okay, and different operating systems too. That's the reason most of the organizations are preferring Selenium because it, uh, you know, it's it's it has its own advantages in terms of money as well as in terms of uh, you know features. Okay, just they need just uh, what the organization need here, just they need a person who has 
non-adjoint selenium. That's it. Okay. Who just they need a person who has non-adjoint uh, selenium. Okay. Now uh, and then we discussed about selenium. I'm just giving uh, you know intro what we have discussed uh, in previous classes. Okay, then we will start with today's class. Give me uh, you know five to ten minutes. Okay, we'll start. Uh, we'll we'll complete the previous session and we'll come back to today's session. Yeah, I can set the demo plus uh, today's session. Yeah. Selenium uh, is a web-based automation tool. Okay, Selenium is for web-based automation tool. It means it's only for web-based, and it has uh, three components. Selenium IDE, it's a Firefox plugin and here we can report, we can replay and uh, we can export into Java format or whatever the format that we want. Okay, then we have Selenium. RC, uh, Selenium uh, driver. This is where we actually enhance our script. And Selenium grid. This is the concept to exhibit uh, multiple scripts. on multiple machines okay so this is a very high level okay so actually today we thought to discuss selenium IDE here okay uh, now before we discuss selenium IDE we are going to discuss about object identification in Selenium. Okay, today we are going to discuss about this. Yeah, I will share this Excel sheet with everyone, don't worry. What's happening here? Uh, no, someone is uh, no, leaving the session, joining the session. Uh, we are getting some uh, kind of uh, no, uh, sounds. Yeah, we'll see. Yep. Now, today we are going to learn uh, this one. Okay. How to identify elements in web page using Selenium. Yep. Say, let me take one scenario. Okay. Let me take uh, this Gmail login. Okay. Say, we have entered, uh, we have uh, opened the browser. where I'm not sure uh, actually the problem is here oh yeah sorry guys the problem is here uh, you know we are raising it seems uh, some trial uh, go to meeting account here uh, it is supporting uh, I think maximum of uh, 25 attendees so when it is going beyond that, uh, maybe it's automatically one, one person is getting session, getting out of the session, it seems. 
Yep. Say, uh, let us come back to this scenario. Say, uh, opening, open browser. Okay. Launch gmail.com. Okay. Enter username. Enter password. Click on sign in. Say this is the scenario. Okay, say just for uh, example, say this is the test case, these are the steps, okay. Uh, if I ask you to test it manually, okay, once you click on sign in, expected, is, expected part is, you should be able to see inbox page, okay, you should be able to see this inbox page, okay. So if I ask you to test it manually, if I ask you to test it manually, okay, how do you test it? If I ask you to test it manually, how do you test it? Can anyone of you guess? So many of our students have given testimonials on how our training programs are. You will find them on kudzu.com and on our website h2kinfosys.com. On our website h2kinfosys.com, you will also find more detailed information on who we are, the courses that we offer, what each course covers. Also, if you are interested in a demo program, please register on our home page on the left hand side. Just give us more information about yourself and we will send you a link for a demo class. The demo class is absolutely free. Experience our commitment by just attending an orientation workshop at no cost. Our team of faculty and advisors are here to guide you with the right information. If you still have more questions, please feel free to call us. Call us at 770-777-1269. This is a United States number. If you're calling from the UK, call us at 020-337-1269. 17615. You can also email us at training at h2kinfosys.com or h2kinfosys at gmail.com. Thank you for watching our videos. We wish you a great career in information technology.